What's good, y'all? Shout out to the notification game for hitting the like button. And the video didn't even start yet. Y'all the village ones in it. I appreciate you anyway. Um, RIP to um uh, Mr. Quella uh, Robinson. I'm hoping I pronounced her name right, man. I'll, real quick, I, I want to definitely, definitely um give her a moment of silence for for what recently happened to her. Yeah, man. RIP, RIP to her. Um, beautiful young lady, and it's and it's really unfortunate. Uh, what happened? If y'all haven't heard already, man, I make sure to put the um. The, the the video of the news uh towards the maybe towards the middle or maybe towards the end of this video so just stay tuned for that but i, I just real quick i just wanted to you know touch bases with y'all and talk to really talk to the ladies honestly man this because this is this is scary this is scary and again for those that does not know the full story about what was going on so apparently uh shanquilla robinson uh took a trip to mexico with so-called friends her best friend right and uh she ends up basically dying on a trip so apparently her friends had spoken to uh Shanquilla's mom and was basically making up things saying oh well you know um she's not feeling too good they think it's alcohol poisoning they think that she drunk the water there you know if you drink water you know from, from another country and you're born here in America you know nine times out of ten you can get sick from doing stuff like that so they were just really throwing out a whole bunch of million different things as to uh as to what was going on with Shanquilla and so the mom was like well let me talk to her let me talk to her let me talk to her and it was like oh she can't talk because of ABC wants to they just kept giving up a million damn reasons um eventually they just stopped answering her phone call when the mom kept calling and it's really really sad man the thing that i want y'all to understand is this man um first of all that it, it, they, they were never her friends that's number one that's that i just want to point out the obvious because there's no way in hell this this supposed to be your home it's supposed to be your best friend this is supposed to be your your goddamn the 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 your homegirl your ride or die your your best friend that's my best friend all that dumbass stuff that that people I'm gonna try not to cuss in this video y'all I swear to God I'm gonna try not to cuss but I it, it this this really kind of pissed me off I ain't gonna lie to you I I ain't even gonna hold y'all this is supposed to be your best friend and you mean to tell me all y'all got y'all ass back on the flight back to America and left that girl body there in Mexico but that's supposed to be your homegirl. You mean to tell me not one of y'all could have stayed with that damn body? Like, come on, bro. That would have been the first red flag for me. How the hell all y'all came back to Mexico and left my child body there? What the hell you got going on? Left the girl's body there, y'all. In the hotel, the damn maid had to find the body. And of course, when they did the autopsy report, of course, it came back. It wasn't no damn alcohol poison. It wasn't no food poison. It wasn't none of that crap. The girl had a a, a spinal cord. Uh, her spinal cord broke. Bruises all on her back. Her head, head contusions. All of that. I can't show y'all. I mean, honestly, I don't even want to show y'all the video. But I can't show you the video, obviously, because YouTube would definitely take the video down. Because YouTube's not going to be able to allow you to um, to even show anything like that. But what I will do is I'll let you hear the audio of 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 the of the fight because they was recording the fight the whole time. So we gonna we gonna we gonna play we gonna play the audio and I'm gonna blur the video out. Okay. Quilla, can you at least fight back? At least something. At least fight back, something. Get up, bro. Get up. Uh -uh. Yeah. yeah, man. Like I, I, I mean, just, just craziness. Just craziness. And the girl that's hitting her again is supposed to be her hunger. And you hear people in the back that talk to them. Oh, at least fight back. Well, look, at least fight back. What the hell you mean? And you, you can hear what she said. She said no. This girl was set up. Sleeping in her damn bed. Woke up really, really right before they, they woke her up right before breakfast and, and they were trying to fight. They, they wanted to fight the damn girl. In my honest opinion, it was because of jealousy and envy. This is a beautiful damn girl. They were, and, and, and again, this is a legend, y'all. But this is a beautiful damn girl, right? Apparently, they went out to Mexico and the guys was all over uh, Shanquilla. They wasn't feeling the other girl. And we look at the other girl, rightfully so. The other girl ain't even attractive. So that's the main reason why she felt some type of way. She was jealous of her and her beauty. 
She was jealous of her and her damn beauty. Ladies, I'm telling you, y'all better be careful. Y'all better be careful. I told y'all the story a while back of the uh, uh, of the little Haitian girl that I used to talk to. I told y'all, I said, yo, listen, um, the only reason why I found out that she was in a relationship is because her so-called best friend told me. I respect her for telling me. I'm not talking down on her. I respect her for telling me. But she just told me in such a manner like, Oh, oh, you shouldn't be with her anyway. She or this and she or that. And she da 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 She ain't even that cute. She ain't even that pretty. And in my mind, I'm thinking, damn, ain't this your homegirl? Ain't this your best friend? Y'all, y'all pull, y'all came, both came here from hating together. Like what 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 the hell is going on? Ladies, I'm telling y'all. Them girls that you talk about, your best friend, your girl, a lot of them is not your friends like that. And fellas, please jump in the comment section and let me and let me know if y'all ever heard, you know what I'm saying, chicks talk about talk down on their best friend like that. I hear stuff like this all the damn time. When I was in Dallas, when I was in New York, I'm over here approaching groups of chicks like, yo, man, listen, I just want to talk to your homegirl. Why you want to talk to her? She ain't even all that. Damn. They were jealous of that girl from the jump, from the damn beginning. This was premeditated, if you ask me. They planned to do this in Mexico because they thought they was going to be able to get away with it and then now that, that'll be it. They planned this whole thing out. Oh, girl, hey, let, you know, let's let's go to Mexico, girl. Let's go there for a couple days and do this and do that. We're going to have us a good old time. Sit there and think about it, y'all. I want y'all to sit back and think about this. Because Mexico ain't no just no last minute thing. You got to plan for this. You got to search for the flights. Search for the hotels. Get an itinerary going if you, if you do if you're doing all the extra stuff. The touring, the clubs, the, the, the parties, all that, all, like the, the, the liquor stores or whatever. All of this stuff has to be damn planned. So she knew from the jump, hey, we going to invite this chick to Mexico and we going to beat her up. We going to do the stand third. We going to leave the body there. Why didn't none of y'all call the police if, 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 if she was damn experiencing all these damn problems? Why none of y'all call the damn doctor? Why didn't none of y'all drive her ass to a damn hospital? Again, I'm telling y'all right now, that would have been my homeboy. That would have been my homegirl, bro. I'm not leaving this country, bro, until her parents come and, and get the body. I'm not about to do that. There is no way in hell, ladies, I, I'm begging y'all. I need y'all to pay attention to me. I need y'all to listen. I wish I could cam up right now, but I'm, I'm at work, so it's all good. Y'all know I, I usually jump on cam, but it's, 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 it's whatever. It's all good. I need ladies to pay attention to me. We here and fellas, again, this is my second time saying this. Please jump in the comment section and, and tell me if I'm telling the truth or not. I've heard stories like this all the damn time with damn chicks when we sliding out, especially in college. Especially in college. We over here sliding to, to a chick dorm. You know what I'm saying? I'm over here, you know, doing doing whatever. You know, she like, oh, okay, I'm going to run to the bathroom. I'm going to be right back. She runs to the bathroom. The chick in the, uh, on the other side of the dorm looking at me like, oh, she this and she that and she da 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 da. I'm just, and, I, and in my mind, you know, I don't be saying that because in my mind, I'm, I already know what time. And I'm like, damn, you jealous of her because I can already look at you. You not attractive, facial wise, body wise. You already hating on her. You hear stories like this all the damn time. Shanquilla and that damn girl was friends for how many years? Who knows how long this, they, 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 she, she been jealous of this damn girl. And as more and the more details that comes out, y'all. Um, you know, of course, I'll try my best to keep y'all updated, but she will be laid to rest apparently this weekend. Um, today, what's, what's today? I'm gonna try to drop a video tonight, y'all. Today's Thursday. I'm gonna try to drop it tonight, uh, if not Friday, but, uh, she will be laid to rest on Saturday, man. Um, and I, I, I just, I feel so sorry for this damn girl, bro. If y'all haven't seen the video, it's all over Instagram. It's all over Twitter. If y'all, if y'all want to watch it, you can watch the video. I, I, I wish I never seen the video. Because this girl was sitting here hitting her all in the head, slinging her around the damn hotel room. Everybody, back. oh, fight back. At least try. At least try to fight. What the hell you mean? At least try to fight back. The girl said, no, she don't want to fight. She don't want to fight. That's soft as hell to me. You over here damn swing on this girl. This girl didn't, didn't even try to damn get up the swing back. She didn't want to fight from the jump. She was probably damn terrified at that damn moment. Just woke up, didn't know what the hell was going on. 
And I feel for the mom and the dad and and and, the, and her father because the, you know they got and again like I said I'll play the uh, I'll play that that news clip towards the end of this video. But they got out here and was completely like bro they they, they, they was distraught. They was like yo she kept lying. They kept doing this. They kept making up different stories and and they just got to the point where where they they just had to call the FBI to figure out what the hell is damn going on. Now they had to launch this whole damn investigation. This is, man, listen. Again, RIP um, to Mr. Quilla Robinson. Um, I, I mean, goddamn, ladies, I'm begging y'all. I'm begging y'all. Please be careful with who you're calling your best friend, your homegirl, your this, that, and the third. Not everybody has their your best interest at heart. I'm telling y'all right in the hell now. I'm telling y'all right to hell now. I've heard cases not not as bad as this, but I've heard situations of like girls being jealous of they so called homegirls so often it's not even funny. Every damn time since I was in hell, since I was in damn elementary, honestly, but since I was in middle school, high school, and it got worse as 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 we got older. I got homegirls that I talk to to this day right now that don't have one female friend because they tell me straight up, I can't trust these females, bro. They they, they too they too jealous of me. They too this and they too that. They're unpredictable. Nobody wants to damn deal with that. All because she's jealous of, of, of her and how, you know, how beautiful she is or whether whether her body looks better than her or maybe her, she probably, <laughs> let me tell y'all something. She probably jealous because she probably got a man and her man always asking, hey, yo, Shaquilla coming? <laughs> Sha Shaquilla joining us? Or oh, we going out to breakfast? Bring your home, girl. She probably got jealous because of that. She got jealous because of that. Y'all in a whole nother country and she getting more attention from the men than you are and you mad about that. That is crazy to me. Anyway, I'm, I'm, man, I'm, I'm done, y'all. Again, like I said, as, as, the, as, as more information comes out, y'all, I'll try my best to try to post everything I need to post, you know what I'm saying? But um, I, I, again, like I said, I'm going to play the, the, the little, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm, I'm going to play the, the, the news clip uh towards the end of this video man but um i want y'all to comment down below let me know what y'all thought about this video man thanks for watching please 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 if you haven't hit the subscribe button man also to hit the bell symbol so anytime I make an upload notification will pop up and alert you also too make sure you hit that like make sure you hit that share i look forward to reading all y'all comments if any so until next time ladies please y'all be safe for her cuz Night at 11, a Charlotte family is trying to figure out what happened to their 25-year-old daughter. Shanquella Robinson's parents say she took a trip to Mexico last month with a group of friends. Her friends made it back, but she didn't. They say she was found dead. They were told what happened, but they tell me tonight they're not buying it. I just sit back and wait on God, because like I say, she's going to get justice. A mystery in Mexico. How did a weekend with friends turn into a nightmare? And something is not adding up right here. Bernard and Salamandra Robinson say their daughter, 25-year-old Shanquilla Robinson, traveled with friends from Charlotte to Cabo, Mexico on October the 28th. I spoke with her Friday evening. She was having dinner. And um, I never spoke with her again. The next day, their world changed. On Saturday evening, they called and said she wasn't feeling well. And they was going to call a doctor. And, but when they called, the doctor hadn't arrived yet, but they said she had alcohol poison. They say they were told their daughter died from alcohol poisoning, but they don't believe that. They say they've heard different stories and none of them add up. We received the um, autopsy uh, report on Thursday and it said that her neck had been broke and, and she had a back spanical. spanical what was cracked. So that took it to a whole nother level. In a statement, the U.S. Department of State said, quote, we are aware of these reports. Protecting the welfare of U.S. citizens overseas is among our top priorities. Out of respect for the privacy of those involved, we have no further comment at this time. Shanquilla's body arrived back in Charlotte on Thursday. She had a heart of gold. She didn't, she didn't, she didn't mistreat nobody. I mean, I can't even be a, a grandfather. Can't even walk her down the aisle. She's gone. Weeks later, questions remain. We're not going to stop until this is, we get to the end of Should it. get to the bottom of it. We're going to get to the end of this. No, nah, this is not going to happen, you know. No, I've been crying, you know. I'm hurt. I'm hurting all the way around.
and the family tells me they have contacted the FBI in Charlotte to help them figure out what happened. They also say they'll hire a private investigator if it comes to that. Their daughter will be laid to rest next Saturday.